Good morning, everyone. So today is uh, Thursday. I just got done with my morning workout. It is about, it's 1040 actually, which is super late for me to get done working out. But um, I just had some things I needed to get done this morning and I have a lot of, well, not a lot of errands to run. I really just need to go to the post office. But nevertheless, I thought I would take you guys along because I'm trying to have like an actual upload schedule of like Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday. So that means I need to film on Mondays and Wednesdays and Fridays. But I figured today, since I had a video go up already, I would just go ahead and film today and then maybe a little bit of tomorrow. I don't really know. But anyways, I just got done working out. I did um, an upper body workout <clears throat> and then I finished with a little bit of abs and <clears throat> some cardio. Sorry. Anyways, I need to get my nails done really, really bad. They look, I don't know why I showed you my hand, like for what? Um, they're just not that cute. They're getting kind of yellow. And it's not cute. So anyways... Yeah, that's what I'm doing. It's not very interesting, but that's all. And then I gotta take a shower. Vlogs are literally pointless. Like, I don't understand. So, before I go and leave the gym while I'm in this, like, good lighting, I feel like my skin has been doing really well recently. Like, it just looks pretty good. You know, like, I'm pale right now. It's okay. I'm gonna be working on my tan, all the things. But as far as, like, my actual face skin goes, like, it looks pretty good. And I've had a few breakouts over here, so I have, like, some little spots remaining. Um, now you can see my nails and how janky they kind of are. But anyways, um, I feel like it's been looking good. So I was going to share some new, not new, but, like, just things I've been using in my skincare routine that have done a good job. You know what I mean? Also, outfits from Amazon. Super cute. Cute Amazon top. These are the Persist shorts. They're really comfortable. Love them. I actually like them better than the little lemon shorts. The alarms just don't work on me, and I don't know why, but they just don't. So, anyway, I gotta take a shower. Alright, so I took a shower. This screen is so dirty. Hold on. I took a shower, and I um, self-tanned, which I don't look that tan right now. Actually, yeah, I do. Had some breakfast. It is, let's see, 12.51. I don't eat until later in the day. And I've been working on a few things and just trying to get everything ready. And um, I'm going to film two videos for Fawn Beauty today. And then, obviously, I'm filming this for YouTube. Because I'm close to being monetized. I really want to be monetized, you know. Because it's something that I enjoy. Making money and making YouTube videos. So, I'm currently in my office. Chilling. Um... I have just some things I need to do, some PR packages I need to send out, and some things I just need to get, oh my gosh, I can't get a lot of them. Some things I need to get finalized for, like, new things that are coming, and so I'm going to do that. I'm going to be working on it for, I don't know, probably quite some time, and then Thursday is actually my date night, so I'm going to go um, get ready for that, and then after I get ready for that, I will then film the videos for Fawn Beauty that whole sort of thing so that is the plan as of right now that is what's happening yeah that's it <laughs> video that I need to film. I think I mentioned this for like my Fawn Beauty account. I'm um, just like telling the story behind it and everything. So I'm going to post it on 
YouTube, and then I'll also have it on um, Fawn Beauty on my Instagram. So I'm just going to go ahead and get ready and um, get ready to do that. I have my curlers in their thing, like heating up. But um, yeah, other than that, I think I'm just going to be, why isn't it focusing on my face? Hold on. I'm in the natural lighting, so if it like goes in and out, that's why. Um, no. Anyways, yeah, like I said, I'm in the natural lighting, so if it goes in and out or like looks super exposed, that's why. Um, but yeah, anyway, so I'm gonna be getting ready for that, and I'm just using my everyday products, um, which I'm pretty sure that I've showed you guys a million and ten times before, but if I haven't, I'll probably post a picture or something like that. I'm gonna be watching probably Jamie Page Beauty, um, talk about her everyday makeup routine, and then probably Miss Taylor Wynn talking about her holy grail everyday basic essentials. So that's what I'm gonna be doing and you guys can see me put on my makeup and my like everyday process, how I do my hair and then like um, I will start filming, change my shirt, you know, make myself look like a little bit more presentable and yeah, that's the plan. So I also have my protein coffee with my cute little giraffe mug. Oh, so cute. <laughs> filming um I'm literally so tired like I'm so tired my hair looks crazy I tried to curl it with hot rollers I tried to curl it with a regular curling iron nothing worked my hair looks crazy um I have a day in not too long I need to get ready for that but before I do that I need to edit this video not this video but the video I just filmed and get it put up on Fawn Beauty which before I do that I have to do all kinds of other editing things for that video so I'm going to go downstairs and sit there and do that. And um, then I guess get ready for my date. I'm so tired. Okay, so I did everything that I needed to do as far as like um, filming and all that kind of stuff. I'm still waiting for the video to upload or like download after edits. Um, but I better go on my date. So I want to show you all my outfit. This is just a cute like little knit top from H&M. My pants are from H&M as well, which I guess, let me see. I can show you. But they look like here. They're like little cropped pants. They kind of look white and like the Anyway, these are from H&M. Oh my gosh. This is like the thousandth time it's kicked me off because it says I don't have enough storage on my phone. Anyways, this is from H&M. This gold chain was my dad's when he was younger. This ring is from H&M. Obviously, my engagement ring. Amazon. And then these are um, H&M. I don't think that we vlog. I'm a vlogger. I've got my stock co-brew here. It's got the um, low and slow. Can it, I can't get any good angles in this place. Look at this. Look at this. I'm oh, sorry. You gotta bend down. We've got the low and slow 10 hour brew. I can't even see anything. How am I supposed to be a vlog legend? Here's those in track. Are you scared? Yeah, probably. <laughs> well, guys, we athlete. just tell him. What? <laughs> Get the creamer. Get the creamer. We're making this video today to, like, let you guys know. To literally, like, let you all know. Literally. That we're breaking up. You're so stupid. But I'm keeping the ring. And we're still gonna hang out and get married. 
that we're breaking it. Yeah. You want to give him an apartment tour? No. I'll just show you guys around. Here's the laundry room. Caleb, had, he just found out some bad news yesterday. He lost his vocal cords. <laughs> like, we literally can't find them anywhere. Show them your cup. <gasps> you were going to reach for that, and then you put it away for what? It's not good for iced coffee. Show him the cup. Not that cup. <laughs> Read it. They can't, they can't, they can't see it. Okay, I literally had to tell you all this because it's too funny not to tell. So I had to go to USPS and like drop off some packages and stuff. And so while I was there, I pulled up and the car beside of me, like this kid rolled out carrying this tray of like bread and like little baked goods and stuff. And I was like, oh bless. And they were Mennonites. And so I was like, this little boy has come, you know, to USPS to like try to sell the workers and stuff his bread. So I'm going to buy some bread from this little boy. God love his heart. Because... My dad used to make me talk to adults all the time about, like, marketing things. And I was just, like, horrified. So, I was like, I'm just going to get some bread from him. So, anyways, he was selling all kinds of, like, random flavors of bread. And he had butterscotch bread, white chocolate bread, um, chocolate peanut butter bread, and, like, all this other kind of stuff. And then he had apple cinnamon. And I was like, that sounds more like a normal, you know, bread type. And so, the girl in front of me got apple cinnamon. And so I was like, oh, dang, like, I don't want one of these random flavors. But he had said that he had some more in the car. So he went out to the car, and I was, or, let me back up. So I was like, do you have any more apple cinnamon? He said, yeah. And I was like, okay, I would love to have one of those. He was like, let me go out to the car real quick, and I'll go get you one. And so he comes back in, and he brings me this tiny loaf of bread, okay, this really small loaf of bread. And I was like, whatever, sounds good, you know. $14? He charged me Fourteen dollars for this world's smallest loaf of apple cinnamon bread, and I was just like, "Are you kidding? Are you kidding?" But then I was like, "Okay, God love his heart." So then he like walked away, and I looked at the lady. I was like, "Dang, that's some high dollar bread," and she was like, "I know, but it's probably so good." So like, obviously, I get in the car and I was like, "I'm gonna eat this bread," but his mom was parked right beside me, and she just like looked at me, she's like, "You know, like, oh, thank you for supporting my son buying his fourteen dollar bread." So anyways, I get in my car and I immediately FaceTime Caleb and I was like, you gotta listen to what just happened in my life. I can't believe this kid like literally charged me $14 for this bread. Like it better be good. And so I try the bread, mediocre at best, come on. I was like, you can't be out here charging these astronomical prices, giving mediocre bread. Who is this? Somebody's at my house. Anyways, so I was like, what good are you doing? Like, and for what? Okay. But anyways, I had to support the kid. So I got this mediocre bread for $14. I don't know. I just, I needed to get that off my chest. Okay, so it is later in the day. It is 3.30 p.m. Um, I had to mow. I actually just got done mowing probably about an hour ago. Um, and I had to come upstairs. And I've just been working. I've been sending emails, uh, PR emails, like literally so many of them. And so that's what I'm doing right now. It took me forever to mow and I really need to take a shower. And we're actually going to have dinner at a friend's house tonight. So I need to like get ready for that. Um, it's a Friday night, but 
I'm really busy. I'm just sending like tons of emails right now for like PMR, PMR, what? For PR packages and that whole sort of thing. So I'm just going through a lot of the people I follow. It's kind of like an issue because I follow a lot of people in Canada or like the UK or something. So obviously I can't really send them a gloss unless I want to pay 30 something dollars for shipping. So, um, oh dang, she put her PR. Ugh. Anyways, so that's what I'm doing right now. And then, um, yeah, I have a bunch of like emails or not emails, but like just messages I need to respond to about like different products coming. And I had to go open up a completely new bank account and I've been like super busy, but I don't feel like I've been all that productive. And I'm so bloated. Oh, I'm so bloated. Oh. <gasps> it's okay. I'll chug the water. Ew. Okay. That's it. That's my update for now. Here we are. Okay, okay. I know this is like the worst lighting ever, but I just got a very, 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 very exciting package from Costbar. Oh, you can't even see it. I got the Mason Francis Le Dijon Baco Rouge 540 perfume. I thought somebody was coming in there and like expose me in my insane purchase, but anyway. I so bad I don't want to mess this up and I don't want to get my like red nail polish, Cajun shrimp is what this is by the way, um, on, on here. <gasps> oh my gosh, a message. Oh my gosh, a message. Okay, what's it say? What's it say? Baccarat Rouge 540, blah, blah, blah. It was born here in France and la-di-da, la-di-da. Great, 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 great. <gasps> it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. Have you ever seen something so beautiful? No, you haven't. I haven't ever smelled it. <gasps> oh, there's a chandelier. Can you see that inside? And Claire interrupted me. It's okay, it's okay. Here she is. <coughs> it's crusty. Celery juice. Anyway, celery juice. Anyway, look at this. Look at this. Yeah, that's right. Oh, I can't wait. <laughs> oh. Smell it. Yeah, smell it. No, I'm making you a name. Smells so good. Not better than my banana. Okay, hold on now. You can make cucumber juice. Why don't you make that? I, don't, I hate cucumbers. Does that not smell glorious? Okay, hold on. Hold on a hot second because. The alt fragrance that's supposed to be a dupe for this is most definitely 112% a dupe for this. Like, hey, babes. 100%. Not a, no question about it. And of course, that's high with her banana. Like, it's stronger. It's definitely banana. stronger and like has a more oil parfum, mm, eau de parfum kind of fragrance. And the other one is higher in alcohol content. Mm -hmm. But as far as like the actual notes of the perfume goes, Identical, like straight up identical. Wow. That blows my mind. Cause the other one is forty dollars. Oh, that makes me feel some type of way. Then I got some essentials: L'Oreal L5, uh, Eight Second Wonder Water, I the VO5 In Shower Hot Oil Treatments. Dad, I just wanted to let you know. My sister's imaginary friend, her name was Jenny, Jenny Hawkins. Jenny Hawkins. She was a good girl. She's long gone now, though. And then I got this um, new curling iron. This is from Conair. It was just, like, highly rated. I got a one and a quarter inch, I believe. Yeah, one and a quarter inch barrel. And then some body oil. Body yaddy 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 yaddy. And... Are you going to mail these? Yes. Yeah. Anyway, my body is and... always so dry. 
jump on the trampoline with you. I am going to go jump on the trampoline with you. Because I'm the best history you've ever had. After the vlog. After the vlog, yeah. I'm not going to use the bathroom. Then we'll go. Poop? You can't say poop on the vlog. Are you going to post this? Yeah. Oh, gosh. I'll take that back, guys. He's not pooping. <laughs> you, okay. you can edit me out saying that. That is true. I might just leave it in there. Anyway, I got these cups. I've seen these a million Here's times them, on... Yeah. Um, where have I seen these? Like other YouTube videos, people talking about cups. And like the things they got from Amazon. Oh, it came with like little coasters. Thank you. Anyways, these are so cute. They're these. They're the double wand, whatever it's called. Oh, what? Okay, you can have it. Um, it doesn't really say, does it? Double walled glasses um, from Kitchenables. This is what they look like. I love them. I thought they'd be so good for coffee. They keep things really Dad. hot, but it doesn't make your hand hot. So I got two of those, um, which I'm excited about. Katie is so on it. You can't get up there. Don't get up there. Don't get up there. Why? Wow. There's all my stuff's up there. Get down. Seriously. I'm putting that here. No, baby. I have a glass over here. A glass? Yeah. Get in, please. Thank you, Diddy Bear. And a good girl. Can Bertie be in the vlog? They need it makes the vlog. Uh oh, look, there's a fancy envelope. You want that? Yeah. Okay. Is it? Please. Well, I'm scared. Hi! Look what I wrote you! <gasps> oh my gosh. Your free gift. P.S. Don't forget to claim your free gift card at Kitchenables. For you. Well, that's nice. And then how? Love that. Then um, a gift card for a hundred dollars. I don't think it was. Oh my gosh! I'll get it though. No, it says. Oh, you, it's a scratch off. You can see how much you want. I'm gonna put this box in the garage. I love scratch offs. I love scratch offs. Anyway, I'm gonna put this box in the garage. Hide the evidence. You know how it is. And then, um. Scratch off. Yeah, I am you. Yeah, that's it. That's all I'm gonna do. That's my little vlog haul for the evening. Okay, I'm going to end the vlog here because I've had quite the work week and I'm tired. It's Friday night and I am watching Jenny and Georgia on Netflix. It's actually a really good show. I picked up some food from a local restaurant and had that at a veggie burger and a salmon taco. And um, yeah, so that's what my night looks like. I'm probably going to have some coffee and hang out with Caleb and work on just some more work so thank you all for watching i hope you enjoy the vlog i never do them so i figured i'll upload one and um before you leave make sure to like and subscribe other than that thank you for watching